Should I just stab myself with a fork now? Cookie. Hello everyone, how are you all doing today? Um, so I heard that pretty girls get paid money if they eat food on the internet and it's called muck bong muck bang anyway <laughs> whatever um since i am trying to be a youtuber i thought i should probably get in on some of the trends now i do realize that canada is losing their minds right now because there's a toronto maple leafs blanket behind me and i'm wearing the sense <laughs> however however you're just gonna have to deal with it i i don't actually cheer for either team so just a comfy blanket and i like the sweater because it's black and has red I like black and red so there's that and so today I thought that for all of you guys I would do a two for one pizza mukbang mukbang muk muk myself up while eating so stay tuned for that <laughs> Hello everyone, I hope you are all doing well today. My name is Beth, or Queen of Spade. Please do give this video a like, subscribe if you're new, and without further ado, let's throw some spade. Um, I don't know what my husband got me. He ordered food, and I have no clue what it is. So that's a little bit fun. Always have pop, because I'm addicted to it. So, um, I don't really understand this whole, like, watching people eat thing, but apparently it's a very big thing. So let's just take a look at everything we have here. Um, I'm assuming this is the main one. So, it's like a surprise reveal of food at the same time, so you should like, be really into it. Oh, drop my fork. That's not good. No! That means someone's coming to visit me. I don't want that. Pull that fork off. Okay. So, poutine, because... Oh, wait, Canadian bitches like poutine. Am I lying? Tell me in the comments if I'm lying. Um, we have the best poutine. So, yeah. My family's from Montreal. And, um, so, I know my poutines. So, uh, yeah, this is it. Apparently, I have to show off the food, so. Cheese, gravy, fries. If you don't know what a poutine is, then what's wrong with you? Why don't you know? So, I guess I just sit here and eat, and we just chit-chat. Um... Again, I, I don't really understand why people like to watch other people eat. I think it's a little gross. I find a lot of the people in this community are actually quite toxic. Should I just stab myself with a fork now? And so because of that, I have a very hard time um enjoying it as content mm. 
Poutine. The trick is, you know, you got to get cheese. All the cheese. You guys are the ones that like doing this. I, I don't know why. I find it very boring to watch someone eat and talk. And, and why is there a whole genre of people talking with their mouth full of food? Anyone? Okay. I mean, I don't have... You want me to talk? Well, I'm eating the food. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Maybe that's half the fun, is that you also get to see the food as it's being grounded. I need an appetite for this video. Oh, you like the drawing? My kid did. It's not bells, I promise. She draws pictures all the time. <laughs> Have some cheese. And you want to get a fry? Watch this one. Oh, sexy. So, every time I tune in to a mukbang channel or mukbang channel, I'm going to say it wrong the whole time, it literally it just seems like drama or like I don't want to sound rude or anything, but I feel like I'm watching two people sitting in the poor area of my old city, just eating food. Should I just stab myself with a fork now? And then I feel sorry for them. And then I'm sad. I don't like watching things that make me sad. That's not fun. So, I just don't watch, like, Nikocado, Avocado, I'm sure he's a cool dude, but I don't watch him. Nikocado avocado. Every time I watch him, he makes me sad. I don't. I don't like watching people upset. It's not like fun for me. I'm not like there's a whole genre up here. It seems of like people that just want to make people upset, and I just I don't get it. So, to me, watching Nikocado Avocado is like wanting to watch someone who cries all the time and is always upset. And I just want to like give the dude a hug and be like, log off the internet. He's just always sad. Like, why are you here if it makes you sad? Internet makes us all sad, though, so, like... <laughs> Did he fake him and his husband breaking up? that's funny.
I have no clue. Honestly, I think he cries more in his videos than he eats. Is that what mukbang is? Am I supposed to be doing like some drama or something? I got none. You got no drama. That'd be a really boring mukbanger. Just be like a group of people hating me all over the internet and me just ignoring them. <laughs> Wouldn't have much drama to share. I'm not very good at mukbang, I'm already getting full. What? I'm not very good at mukbang, I'm already getting full. Yeah. Big fail for me. I don't even know what this like picture here is supposed to be. I think it's her walking the dog that we don't have. She has some fake dogs she likes to play with. And, uh, I think that's what it is, except it looks like a human. Exactly. Her picture in the background of her, of my video, mm -hmm. it looks like a person walking a person. I'm already getting full. I'm like the worst mukbang person ever. I like can't even finish a poutine. <gasps> Fail. So, who are some of my favorite creators on here? Let's have a discussion about that. That's more interesting to me. <clears throat> My number one idol on here. Actually, it's kind of a tie. I'll be honest, but this is a hard choice. I don't know which one I like better now. Anyway, we'll just say two. <laughs> My two top favorite people on here, hands down is Illuminati and Snow the Product. I just thought I'd share that with you. <laughs> I feel like I should have like burped into the camera. Then I'd feel like like diety. I don't want to do that. <sighs> No drama, just spade. <laughs> and so, the next people that I really, really love on here, of course, is my Alonda Recovering Humbot. And honestly, DC Media Girl. I love the recovering hun bot because she's just so sweet and so nice first of all illuminati and snow are just very like real i feel like they're intelligent i like them for different reasons and i love illuminati's like style obviously a, a lot of people actually tell me that i remind them of a, of a like beginning illuminati i'm like oh thank you i'll take that as a compliment but um yeah so 
I, and it's because, honestly, it's because that's who I, like, emulated off of. Because that was the one person that I felt like was, like, the one person I could, like, really emulate off of. Does that make sense? Like, I was, like, she's got some style. And it was similar to what I, like, saw for myself when I came out here. I was, like, I really want a cartoon. I want to, like, come out with a cartoon first. I wasn't showing my face on my channel other than in my channel intro for like months so um yeah it wasn't until about end of November so it was like all of October and November I was a cartoon and then I showed myself and I wish I had waited <laughs> I'm just joking I really don't. I love everything and how everything's happened on my channel. But yeah, Alonda I love because she's one of the very sweetest people in the whole wide world. She's just a very genuinely sweet person. And she's funny as fuck. I don't care what you say. She's a funny lady. If you've ever had like a conversation with her off camera, I feel like a lot of us have to be like more PC than we want to be out here. Well, most people. I'm like probably not in that category but um so yeah she's just a really really funny person and DC media girl I feel like she's just so well traveled I haven't met many people on here yet that are people that have had like careers for a really long time and travel the world and so because of that, I feel like I really, really like her. She's done those things. And I feel like she's someone that won't steer me wrong. She's just a good person. If she makes mistakes, she'll tell me. If she, uh, you know, and I feel like she cares. She, uh, she does a lot of the mukbang kind of like, uh, reactions and stuff. And like talks about Amberlynn Reed. And when some people talk about Amberlynn Reed, I feel like they want this girl to, like, hurt herself or, like, they're almost watching her hoping that she's going to fail. And, like I said, like, that kind of thing really bugs me because I don't like wishing bad things on people. It's just not good karma. I believe in karma. You don't do that. Go and tell the bitch off. But don't actually, like, be wishing. I'm wishing. I'm like watching for someone's demise. I don't get that shit at all. I don't even get hate watching. Like, why do people do that? If I hate someone, I just don't watch them. Okay, that might be a lie because every once in a while I do still check out like a Rexilla video. <laughs> It's because I'm like, is this motherfucker still doing the same shit he was doing, like, six years ago? Yeah, okay. And, um, so, like, I might do that sometimes. But that's, like, once in a blue moon. Usually if it's a topic, I know he's gonna fuck up. So I'm like, <laughs> well, I know this video will be fucking interesting. Or something like that. I don't know. Maybe I'm rude. Um, but yeah, then I'll watch. But, um, it, I still don't want him to do badly, though. Like, I'm, I'm, like, going back and watching in hopes that when I show up there one day, he'll, like, have integrity and morals and everything will be different. And it's just, like, never happens. But I'm not like, oh, oh, I hope that his channel gets shut down. I would actually really hate that. That would really upset me. I don't think anyone's channel should ever get shut down out here. I'm, like, dead against that. Um, I, Leafy got shut down. Here's the funny thing about that. I want to talk about that for a minute, actually. Let's, uh, let's talk about that. Leafy. Gone. He's gone. Just woke up one day. No channel for you, bitch. My channel go. 
<laughs> Apparently, this game starts at Dome 2. <laughs> like a text message. He woke up to a text message from his buddy, like, Dude, where the fuck does your channel go? And he's like, What do you mean? <laughs> it's kind of a funny story, but it's not. <laughs> But here's the funny thing about that. <laughs> Do you guys remember a few months ago when the Onision stuff was going on? Everybody wanted his channel to be taken down, right? Like, everybody. <laughs> Listen. Listen. Susan said she couldn't take down channels at that time. And then she just like suddenly now remembered she could so she could take down Levy's channel. <laughs> what? what are we doing out here? <laughs> Oh, you're creamy on me. <laughs> I did get mucky, like I said I would. There you go. I don't know why. <laughs> there you go. That was a very, uh, diety moment. You can have that. So, yeah. I just thought that was interesting. Anyone else? <laughs> I remember I had a bunch of people tell me I was going to see Chris Hansen was going to get an FBI investigation going. Just takes a while, guys. It just takes a while. Are we still on that? <laughs> still waiting for that proof, guys. I'm not funny, but it is. How do you think this would have gone? If when Chris did go to the ID channel, if he uh, cut a deal to pay, like, Repsion and Jacqueline and a bunch of these guys money, would they still be upset about it? Another one. Do some witchcraft. Apparently it's real, guys. What's in here? Oops. Can you smell that? I gonna eat this whole thing? Do I look like a? I want to be 500 pounds. I'm a tiny girl. I've always been an athletic build, but like not overweight. If that makes sense. Not like super skinny. I still got a little belly. See why I don't do this? Because I just sit here and I just rant about like nothing for half an hour. Like story of my life. <laughs> you know, this could be less crunchy. I have Sam. This is some crunchy cookie. 
feel like you burnt the outside. What's in this? Mm -hmm. Excuse me? My cookie rock hard? What, my cookie rock hard? Good thing I bake better ones. Just saying. I don't know who I'm supposed to be that way. I'm not a mukbanger, I'm just a bonger. Weep. Egg. Gotta do shout outs, you know. <laughs> Oh my god, my hair matches the tomato mafia. I'm all set. Until just now. I'm like, oh fuck yeah. <laughs> I've wanted my hair this color for so long. The whole thing. I have to be honest. I don't have the guts to do the whole thing. I really don't. So, I kept the black on the top. And the underneath is it's a little dark. But yeah, it's like fire engine red. A little bit dark though. Like a, a burgundy version of it. It's not like bright, bright, bright. I didn't want it like... So it's a good, it's a good color. So I finally did it, because Halloween's coming, and I was like, what a better time. Now I just need my black nails. I don't know what I'm going as. What should I go as? I was going to do a hot and bob, but I feel like that would be like too cliche for me. Like, way too cliche for me. So, I'm not doing that. Probably I'm not. This thing's burnt. And I'm mad now. See, my fangs just always make me mad. Always make me mad. <laughs> There's that mad about my cookie. Well, guys, I honestly think that's it. I'm full. I didn't even eat all the food. I feel like a chump. You can say, Queen, you have the worst mukbang, mukbang, mukbang skills in the entire world. And I'll be like, probably, dude. Probably. Anyway. <laughs> I hope that you guys got some kind of enjoyment out of watching me eat a bunch of food and just randomly talk about things. If you want to know anything else about me, you can of course ask me questions down in the comments below. I'm thinking about doing a question and answer video in the next month because some people have been asking me to do that. I'm a little scared for that. I think I might just leave it open to the public. It could be interesting. But, uh, yeah, so I'm probably going to be doing that. I got a lot of new stuff coming for you guys very, very soon. So make sure that you hit like, make sure you subscribe, and hit the notification bell because you don't want to miss anything. No, you don't. So, no matter where you are or what you're doing, I hope that you all have a fabulous, fabulous day. Take care, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! I'm still fucking mad about my cookie. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah.